Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's me, your boy, and we're back at it again with Life is Strange, and we're going to be heading into episode number two. We finished episode one. If you guys missed that, you can go back and watch. We had a bunch going down with meeting Chloe and her stepdad and butterflies and time travel. There was a lot going on in that episode. We're now we're moving on to episode number two, Out of Time, and I hope you guys have been enjoying the series so far. Remember to show your support by leaving a thumbs up. We're not going to waste any more time. We're going to go ahead and go right into this, and we're going to be starting off in the girls' dormitories. Of course we are. Where we just broke into rooms because we don't care. Of Life is Keep that gun away from oh, it even gives you a little bit of a last time on Dragon Ball Z. Little pieces what the time. fuck? But he could be talking about photography. Or have you done something wrong? Talk to me. See, the principal hey, was all on me. What do you want, Max? I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Hey, get away from her, dude. Rubio's Warren, this is between you and me. Don't insult me. Max, go on. Hey! Leave yeah, my dude hit him with the Shibata headbutt. Chloe? It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Welcome home, Max. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Six months ago, she just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. Something happened to her. Wait! Is that grass? <laughs> Tell me the truth. That's an order. You've been snurfing derbs up here, bae. another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. That's quite Max, a tornado. Tell me everything. I mean, it started snowing when it was like 80 degrees outside. I mean, this entire thing is going off the rails. There's a big tornado coming. Honestly, Rachel Amber probably made a very smart decision. I, you know, I don't exactly know what happened to her yet. But if she's out of this town, that's probably good. Because this tornado is going to run through this town like it ain't nothing. Just saying. Oh, I gotta hit snooze. Gotta hit. We're hitting snooze before we even wake up. I don't know if that's too smart, but that's up to you. Oh, we gotta water these plants. Can't forget to do that, man. Plants die, just like everybody in this town at the tornado hits. I'm just saying. She's re oh, she's reading all about time travel. Yeah, probably a good, good idea. You know, if I were you, I'd recommend the anime Steins Gate. Very good. Very, very good. I think you would enjoy it. There's a lot going on with, you know, time travel and stuff like that. Still got that photo wall. Episode number two. Let's hope uh, we get a new ability. Maybe we just start... Maybe it's like maybe it's like American Horror Story where we just start like getting powers left and right. Like it's us now, baby. <laughs> this is just what we about. Oh, we can get up. There we go. Look at this shirt, man. You make that yourself? There's the guitar. We can play that. No amount of rewind will keep me clean. I still need a shower. Yeah, you do. I'm gonna take these supplies though. Okay, Max. Oh, what? Wait a minute. That was shower supplies? Oh, that was lucky. I just picked them up because I thought they were just supplies. I didn't know what they were. I wonder if I'll ever wear a watch again. Is that Pepe the Frog? That's my boy, bro. Monkey ass, monkey ass, monkey ass. What are these? Good morning, clothes. I hope you slept well. Now, shall it be my Gucci shirt with the Vuitton jacket? You got a Gucci shirt. Would Man Ray call themselves your portraits? Man Ray? You talking about my boy Devil Ray? That's my boy. Now I have to wonder if any of these films are based on a true story. You got books, she's got films, she's got it all out here, okay. Oh, we gotta water this plant. Drink up. It's got electrolytes. Oh, you're killing the plants. Stop putting the electrolytes in the plants, come on now. See? I told you! You just killed an entire generation of plants. Let me take a selfie real quick. I just no, woke sir. up. Take your power seriously. Oh, that was a good selfie. She even got the MySpace tilt going on. I like that. All right, let's see. What's on this laptop? You got World of Warcraft yet? Warren is blowing up my inbox now. As long as he helps me figure this out. That's right. Warren knows about this before he got headbutted by my boy Nathan. Hey, Max, the doctor is in the house. I've been thinking long and hard about your weird request. I just sent you a bunch of physics and science links, and without further ado, here's a few time travel films you'll see. 
I'll send more as they come to mind. The doctor expects a full explanation of your newfound chrono interest. Time... Pulp Fiction, there we go. Okay, we out here. Time Cop! Okay, it's getting crazy. That's all the time I have now, as I do have actual quantum physics to plow through. And that's your fun Back to the Future homework. Yeah, yeah, you freaking nerd. This is so insane, it sounds logical to me. Time travel is not just a science fiction. Oh, okay, we in the... Oh, we're in the I Live for Science Facebook. Yo, this is that Facebook page. I fucking love science.com or whatever. Yeah, yeah this, this is the real thing stuff. makes total sense, but doesn't explain how I can do what no science The human trick is to discover the means or device needed to link and traverse both ends of the time tunnel. Huh. Yeah. I would say this is some crazy shit, but now I'm not so certain. Should I say? And I thought I was into Halloween. Dana is not messing around here. Dana said, bring it Blackwell, bloodsuckers. Next to prom night and big football. My favorite time of the year is the annual Ghoul's Day Black Halloween Pate. Is that like the official name for it? The, hey everybody, welcome to the Ghoul's Day Black Halloween Pate. Picture me busting a thriller zombie move. No, I'm not going to do that. Principal Wells has given us a carte blanche to decorate the halls and gym within taste and safety. Okay, so uh, Nathan's got a pretty good outfit. I think maybe uh, the gun really adds to it a lot. Uh, creepy shooter guy really works well for him. Let's get off of that. What you got over here? I could rewind for days and read all of these books. I mean, Will good. I really find any insight into my power? No, we have to find like a skeleton or somebody who probably open, like a wizard skeleton, maybe. Answer. I feel like there's a wizard skeleton in this game. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Trail. Who? Fernando and Kristen? I ain't never met these people. Cartier-Bresson, Doineau, Hamilton, the greatest. Hey, turn the music back on, too. Oh, wait, what is this? I, I pressed the music. It would be fun to get some peeps together and play a real game instead of drama games. Is this Magic the Gathering? You got Magic the Gathering in here? I don't care about the Magic the Gathering card. To get some peeps together and play I'm trying to press the okay. drama games. Click. Yeah, turn the beats back on. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. I thought maybe I could skip it because I looked at it. Whoa. Hello, zombie face. Well, she looked fun. This is what happens when you research quantum physics all night. Let me get my cell phone real quick. Oh, wait a minute. We got messages from Chloe here. What we got here? Whoa! You there, hippie? What about the fucking snow? What about your powers? Whoa, hold on now. You can't just be texting that. I can't go that far back. When you told Step Dork it was your weed. and <laughs> we did do that. We need to talk. Eat an ass buster breakfast at Two Whales? I don't want to do that. It's good to have minions. Got a bail. Breakfast is a go. Meet me at the diner in 40. Uh oh. 40 minutes. Even with all this crazy shit going on, it is so cool having Chloe back in my life again. What is this? Mrs. Hoida is still out sick. I heard somebody say she has severe depression. Poor thing. This school lets you. Wait a minute. This school lets you miss days for severe depression? Damn. Oh, this is my journal. Let us head out. Do not forget I need those papers before tonight. Like now. Thanks, Courtney. Jerry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the test. Oh, yeah, that's the girl that was sitting on the steps with her. I'm so on it. Considered it done. What are you listening to in here? You got Fergie? Hey. Get your butt cheeks back out here. Okay. Fine, I won't disturb you. Listening to Fergie, you got a little too much going on. Look at me, I am ma I am so sick of the slander at this school. <laughs> Get this off my board. Who I'm do we, can we go back in time and see who wrote this? Cause I'm ready to throw hands. Oh. He's good at draw. That's like a that's a good doodle. 314 pa. But what's this poster really trying to tell me? Uh check these titties out. I think so. Yo, Brody, what's going on in here, bruh? No brook here. I thought that said Brody. <laughs> Brody, what's going on, bruh? You just happened to be in the girls' dorm, yeah, bruh? 
Oh, it's that girl that was outside that we uh, we helped her not get hit by the ball. Ow. We'll bang for Jesus. Yeah, let's go ahead and race this. I got something else for you. Oh, we can't draw nothing new up there? I was going to draw something new up there. I guess no one wants to talk. What's up, Alyssa? You okay, Alyssa? Immature assholes. Sorry, Max. I'm not feeling social right now. Okay. One quick rewind and I could stop this TP attack. What TP attack? What TP attack? I There's just one roll of toilet paper, man. Did she get hit by something that I didn't notice? What the hell? What the... I can't stop. No, what do you mean quick rewind? There's nothing I can do here. There it is. Hey, all right. Move, bitch. Alyssa, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. Wow, now that was close. Thank you, Max. Are you wondering how I did it? Because I'll tell you. Time trap. Time trap. Time trap. That's a good thing. Oh, oops. <laughs> right, let me let me erase this board again. We got to make sure we can do everything right. Boom, boom, boom. Skitty dot bop bop. All our stuff got taken back that we Oh no, that didn't get taken back. Okay. That's weird. Alright, where's the bathroom? Let's take a shower. Oh, here it is. Someone's crying in there. Nice atmospheric shot. Needs dusting. Dana? It's that red hot chili pepper shit. Turn it off! Who's surviving what will be left of them? Don't say that out loud. Where's this coming from? Is this music just coming from space itself? I thought it was the computer, but... Okay. Hey. Get down from there. It's like 4 a.m. right now. Get down. People are pissed. It's a riot hey, outside. How are you? Much better than yesterday. I'm glad we talked. Me too. Me too. I know it's good to just talk about this stuff. You're almost psychic. I felt like you knew everything anyway. By the way, the best and biggest news of the day is that Trevor asked me to the Halloween shindig. That's awesome, Dana. At least we're showing our faces together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. Mm. Borrow one of my outfits and come as a cute geek couple with mm. your bitch Warren. Whoa, uh, what? I'm not big on cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. So, are you coming to the party or not? Mmm, let me be sure. Why the fuck not? If I hate it, I can always go back to my room. <laughs> to my That's room? The spirit, Max. <laughs> After this, you'll be ready for a rave. It does sound like fun. That's quite now the I jump. Now I have to go contemplate my party future. It's quite the Oh my goodness. What's going on? That's all this. Oh, no, 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 no. Hmm. Yeah, what the hell's going on here? Speaking of Halloween, look at all this makeup. At least Dana knows how to use it. It is absolutely a skill that you will learn eventually. Is this stuff for the Halloween thing? That is so damn cute how much Dana is into this Halloween party. Hell yeah. You could wear this. I can't even imagine what life would be like being a cheerleader. Dramatic, I guess. Rollerblades. Oh, I wanted to be a derby girl, but I almost broke my feet just putting them on. Yeah, I, you know, probably not the best idea. There's not, I mean, it, you could do it, but I mean, I don't know if you're making much of a living nowadays doing that. Hey, what's going on, hey, Brooke? Brooke? Oh, hi, Max. Hey, did you see the snow? Did you see the freak snowfall yesterday? I was riveted by that weird snow flurry yesterday. That's a weird word to use. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Um, since I'm a science noob, I was wondering if you could explain it. I'm serious. Even meteorologists can't explain that snow. I bet Warren can. Did you talk to him yet? I will later. Lucky you. I'm sure he'll track you down, Max. I'll see you around. Does she like Warren or something? Because that was a little condescending, and I don't know if I like that. Hello, Juliet. Hey, Max. Did you check out Kate's hot video yet? Why should I? Because it's fucking hilarious. Church girl gone wild. Kate's not like that and you know it. Really? 
check her out and tell me what she's like. Do you believe everything you see? Like Zachary sexting Dana? Touche. Now I feel like an ass. Thanks for finding out the truth yesterday. Hold on, well, I need to... What did you do about Victoria pulling that crap? Nothing yet. My mind works in devious ways, too. Glad to see you're back in action. You have a good heart, Max. And I won't watch Kate's video anymore. Or pass it on. That's Could you explain to me? Thanks, Juliet. Sure. I don't know I don't know nothing Talk about this, later. so I'm just saying, you know, if you would like to maybe show me what's going on, that would be neat. I'd be down for that. Hello? Go away. People are sleeping. Okay. Clearly not a morning person. Hello? Taylor is no doubt being led around by Victoria okay. as usual. No need to go there now. Well, I would I would like to go to the bathroom. Take a shower, maybe, but like that ain't happening anytime soon. Oh, the showers are different than the bath. You know, I mean, I'm gonna question it. That's fine. Sure. Oh, hey, Kate. Hey, I. You know, there was a video going around. Hey, Kate. How are you doing? I'm here. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I needed that. Yeah, no problem. I don't like that dude. Anytime. That guy has issues. He does. Doesn't everybody here? By mm. the way, Max, do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. Bradbury. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. She's been crying again. I can see it in her eyes. Okay, we're just going to do a fully clothed shower. One of my favorites. Oh, no, we're good. Okay. Don't come in here now. Soap up. Nathan's going to bust in here with a gun. God help us all. What's up, Kate? That's pretty close. School. That's it. That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Oh my goodness, she was clubbing. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. Um, oh, boo -hoo. I'm sorry I don't like that. Viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up. And you know he has the good shit. Preach Yo. it, sister. Yup, I still have goddamn paint all over my face. Good thing my faithful minions took their sweet time bringing me a towel. We ran all the way- Give it a rest, Taylor. Now I know if I'm in an accident, I won't rely on you or Courtney for help. You can hang out with Kate. Or Max. I thought we were, like, good. I thought we were good. What? I thought we were good. Well, I mean, there is that whole thing She's with... She's a weirdo with that dumb camera. Okay. You know? I hate that I'm so quirky crap. Anyway, let's leave the link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such an evil biatch. I love it. <laughs> what if I break your legs with a bat? I know my boy Nathan's got a bat. Oh, Lord. Get out of <laughs> here with the... She bought a domain? She bought... This is premeditated. She bought a domain to forward to this video. She uploaded it. FTP. Bro. Let me see what's going down over here. Hold on now. I better get dressed and go give back Kate's book. And what is going on here? Get Even this if out I of can here. stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. Oh, goodness gracious. Why is I here with Kate? She knows Nathan. Oh, Sorry. shut up. I forgot. Uh, the... See, they brought up the Nathan thing. She said, you're gonna be sorry? Yeah, I don't know about that. She's friends with Nathan. The last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. 
Yeah, that's how, you know, it kind of works like that. But okay. I'm good to flow. Thanks. Hey, what's going on in here, bruh? Hey, what's going on in here, bruh? Took that ass up, bruh! Guards! <laughs> Guards! Uh, I'm, I'm coming out. Hey, what's going on out here? Anybody, anybody, uh, linking any more URLs to Kate's vid? Because we should not do that. I need to go get my different clothes on here. I can't be walking out like this. I got, oh yeah, I got my Versace clothes. Hold on now. My Gucci shirt. Maybe I'll just put on a shirt and jeans. Hey, That's Einstein what you had usually the same wear. exact suit for every day of the week. And he couldn't even rewind time. Yeah, and he was a big nerd, so Hold that's up, up to you. I need to find the book before going to see Kate. Oh, yeah, yeah. Where's that book? Is it here? My desk is a pigsty, but I know it ain't there. Here? And nothing here. Where did we put it? Here? Ah, the... Oh. Of course she just spilled soda on Kate's book. And you just put the paper back down. What are you, I dumb as bricks? I don't want to add to our list of problems. Okay, move the cup. Be gone, foul softer. <laughs> Be gone! <laughs> Aha, you sneaky book. You're mine. Okay, let's take the book and get now out of here. I can finally take this back to Kate before I'm late. As if I have to worry about being late anymore. I do have all the time in the world now. That is so true. Oh, we got a, hold on, a private number. Keep your smart mouth shut about everything or I'm coming for your ass. I know where you sleep. Bruh. Whomst the fuck is that? Yeah, your principal sent me an email that says he's concerned about your attitude. That ain't me. I hope you don't forget to water the plant we gave you. No, I'm, I'm good. We know oh, we're working shit. on it. Now I'm getting anonymous threats? It never ends. This has to be from Nathan. Nathan's Wait, wild. I would not be surprised. You in there? Yes, I'm here. Come in, Max. All right, let's see what Kate's room's looking. Okay, we got a little. Okay, we got. Oh, 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 oh! We got a little violin. Little violin. Kate used to play the violin every morning. She stopped last week. This ain't good. Okay, we need to go ahead and talk to her then because. So stuff's about to go down. She knows Nathan. I don't like this. I don't like what's happening here. Kate even makes notes in her Bible. My parents never once took me to church. Come to me, I had nothing to all rebel you against. who are weary and burdened, and I will I give you rest. I don't know what to believe now. That's, these quotes are, um, when justice is done, it brings joy to the righteous, but terror to the evildoers. Yeah, okay, we need to talk to Kate. Okay, some things need to be talked to, because this is about to Damn, be a real bad situation. Damn, it's the all-American zombie family. It's way too emo in here. Kate isn't that gloomy. Yeah, that's why we need to lately. stop this. Ouch. She left out amnation. Dear Katie, no spirit or devil could have pre presented me for what you have done in that videotape. And like, oh, prepared me for what you've done in that videotape. And like a Jezebel, you released your harlot image before God's eyes. She even put it on the good paper. I will pray for, I will pray with my church for your soul to be saved. Oh my good. Auntie Marsh, bruh. Let me see. Oh, another nice little rabbit here. Do -do 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 -do. I was very scared, though. I hope you don't mind that I just, you know, took that photo. Let's see here. I had no idea that Kate ever hung out with Alyssa and Stella. Hey, we know Alyssa and Stella, kind of. Stella was, you know, hey, nerd I'm boy. I'm trying to use my powers for good. Kate really has a doting father. You will always be my brightest light against the dark. I don't know anymore. Annie Marsh was pretty pissed. Why did she cover up the mirror? She Kate, it's not even that schnurious. It's not that schnurious. Almost forgot what Kate looks like when she smiles. Look at that ice cream cone. Uh, hey. Hey, Kate. I brought your book. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? Um, I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. I was hoping he would, but it's nice to see that you care about me. Kate, I actually do care. 
So, what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah, right. Is the Vortex Club, like, shooters? Yeah. They just got, everybody's got guns in the Vortex Club. Like, we were really wild out here. What about this video? And I swear I haven't watched it. I can't even watch it, Max. Should I watch it? Just for posterity? Are you kidding? You know how humiliating this is for me? No, because I haven't I seen the video. It sucks, Kate, but tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of it. It's not even that bad. That's awful. So, how did that happen? It's a long story. I'm still trying to sort it all out. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine. And then I drank water. Mm-hmm. Not enough to get wasted, is it? I don't get wasted. Ever. I take a sip at church and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? okay. Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Bro, Go what on. is... The Vortex Club is and wild. And Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Bro, this dude... Can somebody take his ass out back? This dude. Nathan Prescott? Oh, shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. I am so sick of this dude. Of nice. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. And I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And... And what in did what? And that's all I remember. I don't know what happened. You're lying. I woke up outside my dorm room the next day. I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. So, who took the video of you at the party? I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. You know, Victoria did have a URL. Shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate. You can contact the we'll internet. Figure it out. They'll take it down ASAP. I'll check back later, okay? Thanks, Max. You can put my book here near my bag. Okay. Do we need to like get up with somebody or So Max, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Yeah. Absolutely, Kate. Anything. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. He did not help you. Should I go to the police? Mm. 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 Do we bury Nathan Prescott right now? Do we take care of him or do we look for proof? Mm. He did headbutt my boy. Gave him a black eye. He did kill Chloe twice, and then we had to go back in time. Huh. Hmm. Personally, let me think of the repercussions of the situation here. If she goes to the police, Nathan Prescott... Okay, see, that's an issue, because then Kate will get buried, because Nathan Prescott... You can't just... See, because Nathan Prescott's got too many connections to the town. He's got connections to the principal. He's got connections to pretty much everybody. So if we go to the police without proof, I feel like Kate's going to get buried and then she's going to kill herself. And we are not going to have that happen. We are not going to have that happen. We are going to look for proof. We're going to figure out the situation. And then we're going to strike all at once. And it's just going to take down Nathan Prescott forever. He's done. That's it. So if we go to the police right now, it's not going to work because you know what? He's probably got cahoots with the policeman. So, no. We're going to look for if proof. If you do that, they won't believe you. You're on video grabbing at all those guys and they'll use that against you. Bad. But I know I was drugged. 
That's what you have to prove, not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, no, Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. There's no good situation with this. There's no good situation with this. Good job, Dr. Max. She didn't like what I had to say, but we need more proof of what happened. I... I gotta... I can't... I can't, in good faith, tell you to go to the police after I remember what happened. One, I've seen the dude with a gun many times. Two, I just got a, a creepy text. Three, the principal was going to slide this under the rug when this dude had a gun. Now, I can't tell you to go to the police because that shit ain't going to work. It just ain't going to work. I, it just ain't going to work. Is that anime down there? It, it just ain't going to work. I don't know what to tell you. Kate's art is perfect for a children's book. Everything looks so fun and colorful and positive. Yeah, not anymore. Just don't, just don't do anything rash. Okay, we'll figure out the situation here. I got to figure out this Nathan Prescott situation too. All right, so let's uh, let's let's. Oh, oops! I'm coming! I'm coming! I'm coming! I'm coming! Two whales! Yeah, yeah, the ass blaster! I'm gonna be there in a minute. Yeah, eggs and toast. I like emojis. Just chill. All right, let's get out of here. Leave your door open. That's fine. Breakfast. How do we even get there? Do we have a car? Do we walk? Or like, what's the deal here? Is it close to the school? Hello? Yo, it's my boy Sam. What's going on here, Ray? You with the pigeons? The birds are flocking around Samuel. They like him. Hey, Samuel. What's up, bro? You're up early. Oh, hello, young Max. I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm and quiet. And I can feel the animals waking up with me. That's pretty neat. That's one thing I truly love about Arcadia Bay. It's all those cool animals in the forest. The squirrels always come in the morning for food. I can hear them whisper. What animals do you see in the forest? I see some deer. Don't laugh, but I saw a doe that seemed to be looking right at me. Like it was trying to communicate. Oh, that's your spirit animal. Nothing weird there except you saw yours. Could be a sign about your destiny. <laughs> what do I know? My spirit animal is a squirrel. So, what did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Another message from the Earth to get our shit together. <laughs> I will say that Samuel hasn't seen anything like that before. This man talks I like the rock. To get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. You know, I like Samuel. I think he's a cool guy, and I'm down with the Sam. The paint job looks great. Samuel knows his color schemes. I mean, Sam, hey, Sam is a very talented guy. I think a lot of people don't look at this dude like they should. I definitely won't play with this thing again. Why is that? I think you should. How did Samuel get photos of Rachel posing? No, hold on now. Hold on now, Sam. What's going on? Hold on now, Sam. Hold on now. I've never seen Samuel wearing shades. And what's with this other crap? No, hold on now, Brett. Samuel really should keep this locked. It's a waiting hour. Hold on now, Brett. Whoa, 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 whoa big dog. What's all this? What's in this door here? What's going on here, Sam? You know, Sam, I was just talking about how much I liked you. And then we get some of this malarkey. I'm gonna need you to explain yourself, Sam. Can I talk to him about that? Hey, buddy. Hello again, Samuel. Hello again yourself, Max. Sorry to pry, Samuel, but... Why are there photos of Rachel Amber in your shed? 
I'm curious about her. Sorry to pry, she says while prying. Now everybody wants to know about her. So did you know her? Like I told the police. She was a good egg. And she gave me those photos. Mm -hmm. You talked to the police? Rachel wanted to be a model. Yeah. She gave out headshots like squirrels chasing food. Keep on prying, Max. Sounds like you have a lot of time on your hands. I so don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. And now the of course you will sounds a little creepy. I'm just making sure, you know, I was just asking about the damn thing because Hi, it's weird. Hi, Taylor. Just Brett. because you were nice to Victoria doesn't mean I have to be nice to you. Okay, okay. Uh, you know, let's not, let, let's not fight. I don't want to fight with you or Victoria. Instead of smack talk, let's just talk for once. You're funny. Well, I'm not doing anything at the moment, so talk. Okay. Uh, how do you like your knees? Scrambled or over easy because I'm going to take them out. <laughs> Kate is really upset about the video. All this gossip is cruel. Boo-hoo. That's what happens when you preach to everybody about sex. She'll live. Why do you hang out with Victoria? She's pretty mean to you and Courtney. And she's bossy, too. Look, you don't know her. I do. Okay. And she's one of the best friends you've Rachel had. owes me money. I guess I've had mean, bossy best friends, too. Better than having mean, bossy parents. I would love it if my mom was mean or bossy instead of sick. Oh, but whatever. We've had our talk. Ooh, we can change this situation real, real quick. Hey. Hi, Taylor. Hi, Taylor. I've heard that your mother was sick. I'm so sorry. What, what happened to her? Well, if you do care, my mom had back surgery. Victoria was there for me. Like you are for Kate. I'm not about tearing people down, Max. I know. That's why I wanted to talk. I'm glad we did. Look at that. Situation's changing. Shouts out to time travel. We really out here. All right, now how in the world do we get to... Let's screw the plate. Who's this? Max, come Yo, on big here. dog. Warren, what are you doing here? Oh, nothing. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Uh -huh. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. By the way, thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. I owe you. Yeah. Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You're Pause. a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully, and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's yeah, pretty punk rock. How do you know her? Oh, we used to do smack out there in the brat. An old friend. Chloe Price, we haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? Um... I busted him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. I was too scared to tell Principal Wells. Please don't say anything. I'll give you more info later. Weird fucking week. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday. I, I like, you know, I like Warren, so I'm gonna keep him in the mix. Having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Mm. Let's go ape. Uh, sure. Yes, that's exactly what I need. I love those old school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool. I'll text you the info. Yeah, no problem, Warren. See, I like, I'm gonna keep you in the mix, bro. You're gonna get shot, but that's okay. Because, I mean, you know, you're cool with it. We gotta take. Oh, hold on. We gotta take a bus. I just realized. David that. talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has something to do with Kate. We can go or check it Rachel. out. I guess we can't check it out. Okay. They just got a bus that takes you around town. That's pretty neat. Yo, check this. Oh, wait a minute. Was that Evan? What's up, bruh? He's chilling on the bus. I see. I thought he was the bus driver at first because the way the camera's positioned here. 
Oh, we got the buds, bruh. Take me away. I'm about to get an ass black <laughs> ass <laughs> an ass blaster breakfast, baby. Yeah, ain't nothing better than taking a big old shit after eating breakfast, huh? That's what good they had me. Ain't nothing like a good old fashioned dumpster in the toilet, you know? Yeah. <laughs> look at all, look at this town, man. It's so good. And about to be destroyed. Oh, you shouldn't go to sleep. There's probably like 200,000 germs on that window, bro. I'm gonna need you to get your head off of it, too. That's nasty. Wait, I just realized we didn't even tell him where to go. Is there like a central point where this bus goes to? Like a bus stop, I guess, and then you just walk from there? Oh, there's a lighthouse. Here we go. Yeah, I guess it is the central point. Everybody off. Okay, we're just me. I don't know how this whole transportation is. Four dollars and seven cent. Don't try to take it from me. It's mine. Who is that? Dream of it. I'm gonna be a millionaire. More? Steals my lottery. Talk about going back in time. The diner looks exactly the same. Are you guys waiting for the bus too? Hi. You look lost. Close. Do you know if the bus has come yet? The you just online schedule it. isn't working. I just got off the school bus, but I'm sure the regular bus is coming too. Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> I can't be late for this job interview. I can't believe I have to take a bus all the way to Newport just to find a second job. Are things Aww. that bad here? Where are things good? I can't even afford to live here. Well, good luck. Thanks, I sure need it. Yeah, no problem, lady. What about you, old man? No time for chit-chat. I'm a millionaire. Yep. Got my lottery ticket right here. Waiting for the bus so I can cash it in. Yeah, let me get that thing. Why don't you give it to her? She can't even afford to live here, bruh. You can't have my lottery ticket. Buy your own. Man, shut up. Give me that lottery ticket. What are you talking about? I'm right beside it. It's right here. I'll be there in a minute. I just, you know, give me you the lottery ticket. Lottery give me the damn ticket. lottery ticket right now. Do you understand me? Give me the damn lottery ticket. Do you understand me? I bet he's seen a lot of changes to Arcadia Bay in his lifetime. How do you do, fellow kids? Oh, what's going on out here? What's up, bruh? You selling fish? Good morning. Looks like you're ready to catch some serious fish. I wish, young gal. Arcadia Bay just isn't the same fishing town I grew up in. Has the town changed much? By Neptune's beard, it has. This man said by it's Neptune's like beard, bruh. When I was king of the harbor. You have your own boat? I call her the Bali High. I've kept a hold of her in these lean days. Might be all the time we've got left. I thought one of I'm, you don't even know. Fish. Oh, the fish used to jump onto my boat until the Prescotts and their finance fiends snapped up harbor rights. The Prescotts have a lot of power. They might rename the town Prescott Bay, if that tells you much. That is insane. They own my school. Crooks gain respect when they put their names on schools and libraries. Let's not get downcast. I hear the fish calling for Bali High. Never forget that old fishermen never die. We just smell that way. Yo. I'd love to learn more, but I have to get going. Happy fishing out there. That's a cool guy. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Yeah. What's his name? RJ MacReady. That's my boy right there. Follow me on Weeder. <laughs> Someone follow him, please. Yo, what's up, bruh? Oh, okay. 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 Rude. Hey. I'm here for the ass blaster special. 
Man, Y'all got that or what? Breakfast and the sound of clangs. Good lord. Talk about apocalyptic. Yeah, yeah. Where's Chloe? Hey, hey, hey. What's up, Brett? USA, Brett. Did you catch any big ones today? If by big you mean none, then sure. I caught a lot of big ones today. Okay. Now let me mourn over my eggs. All right, well, fuck you too, bro. I never cared about you anyways. Weird lady, that's all I like to see. Hello there to you. Okay, Such yeah, I'm not going to talk to you. Day, eh? nope. Oh, yeah, it's going to be a super day. Enjoy your breakfast, eh? What, are you from Canada or something? The fuck? Oh, man. I bet that's the same gum from when I was here last. Ain't nothing wrong with that. I might make Chloe check this out with me. So, ooh, Sasquatch. What's back here, man? Oh, graffiti. Flush before pissing on the floor. That graffiti has been here forever. Gross. Rachel A owes me a BJ. So does your mom. Ray. Oh, take a photo. Photos are always good. There's Rachel Amber. Yo, there's that deer. Arcadia Gay sucks dick. Thank you, redneck poet. That's lit, bro. I mean, I really thought about that one. What's up, big boy? What do you want? I feel like shit. Too much beer. All right, well, eat ass. Fair. I didn't care no way. Oh, the unexpected snowfall. Quietly. Oh, the, the sound just turns on randomly. Coming up at noon, K-Bay 7 News will explore the mystery of yesterday's unusual snowfall on a warm and sunny late afternoon that confused and delighted Arcadia Bay residents. We'll be talking hmm. with Portland meteorologists in the area and look at some of your fun video reactions to the odd snow flurry. Oh, we got some Snapchats. Oh, maybe Mother Nature was pranking us all. So stay tuned to K-Bay 7 News for the real story. Tomorrow, there will be fire that rains from the sky. Things will go a little different. Hello, sir. Hi, young lady. You look a little lost. Just hungry and thinking about what to eat. Now, that is a real problem at the uh, two wells. I can never decide. Joyce's pumpkin pie or grilled mac and cheese? We're going to get that grilled mac and cheese, my boy. How well do you know Joyce? I know her delicious grub. Everybody at the station comes here. We take care of this place like it's our own kitchen. And Joyce, like she's our, our mother. Oh, okay. I guess you're friends with David Madsen. I wouldn't use that word. We know each other. Why do you ask? Because he's the literal worst. He kind of has a reputation at Blackwell. I have respect for David. He served his country. He found his calling at Blackwell. At okay, station, so I can't talk to you. We're happy David is exactly where he is. <laughs> Not everybody can be a cop. Yeah, you. <laughs> so, yeah. You know Chloe? Sadly, we all know Chloe down at the station. Poor Joyce. Just heard that Chloe even had a pot dealer in her room. Mm-hmm. That's, uh, that, that won't me or nothing. Let me tell you. Not, you know, it's just weed, you know. <laughs> uh, who told you that? I didn't hear it on the police scan. Joyce said the weed belonged to Chloe's friend, but I highly doubt that. Joyce didn't tell you who? She wouldn't. Afraid I'd go arrest somebody, as if I would. I'd just tell the loser to stay the hell away from Chloe. Or else. Yeah, what a loser. <laughs> Just kidding. Besides, David Madsen's watching her. Is she a friend of yours? Uh, you know, um, I you know, I'm gonna go. I have to go now. Enjoy your breakfast. By the way, one thing I can tell you for certain is to stay away from that RV outside. I usually stay away from sketchy parked vehicles. Why you want policy? me to go check that RV? The guy who lives in it, Frank, is pretty sketchy himself. That's all I can say for now. I should finish up my coffee and get to work. You know, I feel like I should go check out that RV outside. I'll be back in a minute, Chloe. I know we're supposed to get blah blah blah, but I gotta get to this RV only outside now because my man's only to go check it out. What's going on over here, RV, bruh? You doing something neat over here, bruh? There's that dirty RV from the other day. Yeah, we didn't even put. Last episode, we were supposed to do something on the window. We didn't even do nothing on the window because I didn't even see the damn RV yesterday. What's going on? Here? Oh my Stop goodness! That. Stop! No barking. What's up, bro? Okay, I guess we are uh, we are not talking to this dude. Just gonna kill you. There's something creepy about that guy and his dog. Yo, wait a minute. No, no. Shut up, doggy.
don't fucking run the corner of the swift. Okay, or not. Okay. I guess we won't do anything with the RV unless I climb over it. I thought maybe I could go this way, but... I guess there's truly, truly nothing we can do with the creepy dude and his dog. Hey, what's going on in here, bruh? Y'all got the ass blaster breakfast? Wait a minute, I feel like I've done this before. Trevor and Justin, what nerds. Hey, Trevor. Holla, Max. By the way, I know you saw me in the dorm. Yeah, I saw you coming out of Dana's room. Yeah, and I finally had to tell Justin because, well, he was into her too. Oh. How did Justin react? I got him blazed. <laughs> he was cool. Nobody has secrets in Blackwell anyway. See you in class, Max. See ya. What's up, Justin? You smoke weed, Brian? I, I smoke up, weed too. I'm the king of, I'm king of weed. Get my coffee on before I cut class and destroy some rails. Shouldn't you be taking photos? <laughs> I am always taking photos. I am a camera. You crack me up, Maxer. Of course I'm baked. It's so all laugh at anything. That is mustard. That says mayo on that battle. bottle. That is mustard. So all your homework, school girl. School. Speaking of buds, I saw your bro Trevor sneaking out of Dana's room. Ooh. Trevor finally told me about him and Dana hooking up. He got there first, so I snooze and I lose. See you later, Max. Oh, okay. See you, Justin. Weirdo. Freak. What we got up here? Drool. Want everything. Yeah. Give me some of that good good. I'm gonna change this song right now. Let me get a guitar tune up in here. Well, okay. What are we messing with over here? Forgot about the fishing wall of fame. Yeah, we got none of that no more. No more fish nowhere. Now, where's Chloe and the damn food? Didn't you say you were coming over here, Chloe? Let's see here. Running late, grab a booth at the diner. Okay. So just grab one of these open booths. There we go. And there she is. A lovely young woman. Yeah, that's How me. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I it's smell nice weed. You, you look the <laughs> same. <laughs> like I'm still a waitress at two whales after all these years. It's okay. No, like you still look pretty. Ooh, that's nice. Nice save, kid. You're still smart. But not that smart. Now you get busted for smoking pot. Yeah, that's true. I heard the whole sordid story from David. I'm sorry this was how you had to meet him. He's a good man. No matter what Chloe says. Yeah, I'm sure. I don't even smoke, like, ever. It was almost an accident. It was very stupid. I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, it surprised me fierce. I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Promise. I know things were hard for you and Chloe. I feel bad I didn't call. Now my folks are in Seattle, and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. You did the right thing. You moved forward with your life. I did True after that. William passed on. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, I hope we see more of you. Chloe needs an old friend again. Joyce, I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. I'm glad, Max. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Now you got this Even if Chloe horrible David, yet. dude. Chloe understands. She just needs time. I know that sucks for you. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. Nah, he's just a... I see why. I mean... Do you? He's not as much of a hard ass as you think. Do you know about the surveillance you cameras? You did tell him you had a joint, right? You took that responsibility. Let me, uh, let me tell you about David. David scared me when he said he might have my scholarship taken away for that stupid joint. Nobody's in trouble over a doobie, Max. And I admire that you took the heat for Chloe. Yeah. <laughs> great friend. But you know. Chloe does push David, and it's not fair. He paid his dues in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. I don't know. I saw him bullying somebody. 
He cares about Kate Marsh? David mentioned her, but I stay out of his business. I won't patrol Blackwell, and he won't cook at the diner, you know? Yeah, I saw sure. him arguing with Kate. I thought you might know why. Nice try, Nancy Drew. But next to you, there's only one student I'm worried about. And she's not even in school anymore. You're talking about Kate Marsh? So, now <laughs> Give me the let's news. get down to the nitty gritty. What do you want to eat? You got one of them ass blasters? Belgian waffle or bacon omelet? Ooh, we're gonna go with the waffle, baby. The last good Belgian waffle I had was here when I was 13 years old. So, bring it on. Bring it now on. Now finish your coffee. Tell me what to do. There better be all kinds of creamer in this. I ain't playing no damn black coffee, bro. We get it. For the hungry girl, pronto. Nerd graffiti. Warren must have been here. Gotcha. Yo, bro, you better sit down. Breakfast. What's this over here? Hold on, a menu. The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. A breakfast cheeseburger, bro. It's crazy out here. Let me. <laughs> This ain't no monster this is zero like carb. Dimensional deja vu. I, I keep going back in time. This is a diner, not a bar. No beer? <laughs> do I need to do something to you? Stick with bacon. Let's look the out this window. Is so mysterious. I wish I could stay in this moment forever. I mean, technically you could. I, I could just keep I pressing the L. Yeah, yeah, I was like, I could keep pressing the L button. But then it wouldn't be a moment. Yeah, no true. Beer. What, what kind of dive is this? Drink up. You'll love this. I'm drooling like a baby. Still can't believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, ugh. Oh. Speaking of, Speak of such. Hey, yeah, weed, baby. Mom and Max, together again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. Are you atoning for yesterday? Oh god, mom, please do not give Max any shit for that. She apologized. I know she did. Max is a good girl, but woman. She's 18 now. Too old to get lectures from you or Sergeant Pepper. Sergeant Call him Pepper got gotcha your ass, want boy. To be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. What? No, I give her two. You guys are. She's got a gun. Another reason to blow this town. What is this shit on the jukebox? Yo, I put that on. Now that that's out of the way. Oh shit. Okay. Let's talk about your superpower. Shit. I don't have any explanation, and I can't explain why I saw that crazy fucking tornado. Come on, that's just a daydream. I want proof you can rewind time. All right, how? This how do I give you proof? This is happening so fast. We'll Dude, we can eat this Belgian right waffle here, like now. 200 times. I just realized that. I can tell you every single thing you have in your pockets. You have x-ray vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pockets. Let me see. Okay, Max. Impress me. Okay. Gun. Let's see. A gun? I left it in the car. Eh, wrong answer. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Do we have to remember this? Is this a, is this a puzzle? Cigarette, that keys, was beyond epic penny. Fail. You even made me want to believe you. Something, that, some piece of yellow paper. Well, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. Keys. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. There was a bear on it. No, it was a bear. There was a bear! I swear to God, it was a bear! A skull? A uh, skull keychain for a punk like you. That was so... It's a bear! Punk. It's a bear! Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you... Do I actually have to look at it? Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. Bear keys. Cigarettes. 
One, two, three, four, five, six pennies, three quarters, and a nickel. And a warning ticket for out of parking bay. Let us go back to the beginning. Come on, quicker than that. Come on, go, 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 go. There we go. There we go. Okay. There we go. All right. Okay, Max. Cigarettes. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? Are you fucking serious? Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. I knew that. Something else in my pockets? I'm the man. I'm the man. We're gonna say. Keys. I'm the man. We're gonna Duh, say. Way too easy. I I'm need the man. Details. We're gonna say. Describe my keychain. Okay, there's a bear on it. Panda. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. You do have that Irish luck, Caulfield. What else? Oh God. Hmm. Some money. Clearly, I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? Oh shit. Okay. Um. I don't cents. remember. That's right. Living large oh, in our I, 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 I remember the whole time. Cool. I was just more. playing, y'all. I was just stringing you along to see what. I, yeah. A parking ticket. You know me well. But what is the exact time I was busted? 10.34 a.m. Booyah. Max can tell genius. time. I'm a, I'm a genius. Write it down. I'm a genius. I, I'm, the, I'm the king of the world. Amazeballs. I literally just got chills all she, over she my head. She just said amazeballs. You uh, well, have powers. Yeah, I know. And I can eat this Take Belgian waffle crap forever. Off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. How's the food, Max? It's so good Better I can eat it again. Hungered. Very good save. Man, I'm hungry like the wolf. Clearly. I am freaking out about what just happened. You you have to show me more. Something way cooler so I will believe you without any doubt. Okay, okay. All right, here we go. Here we go. I will predict the future. Ooh. No way. Now, yeah, what, what? pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Okay, mom's walking with coffee. Oops. Oh, did she you break it. another cup? Really? No nope. refill for you. This dude dropped his cup. That's what happened. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Okay. Weird girl goes to bathroom. Okay. I think. That's the best song. This is yeah. sure the hell better than that other garbage. Okay. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So what are you waiting for? I'm just making sure that I understand now, what's happening. Pay attention happened. to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. I'm going to predict Four events that oh, will damn happen it. in the next 30 seconds or so. Okay. Um, trucker. The trucker drops his mug and Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens next? Um, it's not the cops radio, is it? Shit! Ah... Uh, Ah, uh, it's not on his radio. It's outside. Ah, uh, is it on the radio? It might be on the radio. The actually. cop gets an emergency alert on his radio, and he quickly exits the diner. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Ah, fucked up. Okay. Joyce and Trevor fight, and Joyce beats them, and Joyce stops them, and Joyce doesn't care, and Joyce encourages. I think Joyce stops him. Justin and Trevor are fighting, and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. And then the jukebox. 
goes crazy as a cock a fly what i didn't see anything land on it i'm blind <laughs> i'm legally blind as the trucker sure the trucker the tr the jukebox goes crazy as the trucker tries to play a new song pretty bizarro max but let's see if everything happens like you said I didn't see any. I didn't see a cockroach or a fly or anything. Maybe I wouldn't. I just wasn't looking at it. Right. Dude, did yep. you break another cup? Really? No okay, way. Next. For you. Shh. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? There we go. You're a I think dick. not, Max. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He Three. started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. Son of a bitch. This is a sad day in Maxwell. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. Three for four is pretty good. How was I supposed to see a cockroach? So what are you waiting for? Are you? I swear to everything in my life, bro. I swear. Why don't you just believe me? Why don't you just believe me? There's nothing. You just need to believe me. I'm going to. Okay. Uh. Trucker drops his mug. So what happened? Then alert on the cops radio and is it he leaves? He didn't leave. I didn't see him get up and leave. He answers. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and he answers it. Well, let's just see how And then Joy stops them. Just this is getting good. And then a cockroach. There we go. The jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. All right. There we go. Trucker gonna drop the mug. And hey, what's up, honey? Stupid idiot. Oops. All right, there you go. Drop Could the you mug. Break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? I think dick. not, Max. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. And cockroach on the jukebox. Come on. Oh, yeah. Davy Jones locker. Fucking A. I know. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. This is sure as hell better than that other garbage. Davy Jones's locker. So what are you waiting for? What did I miss? What did I miss? I'm go the cop thing. The trucker. So. Um. I guess his partner leaves. The cop I didn't gets an emergency alert on his radio, and his partner in the car leaves without him. Well, let's just. That was it. Okay. So he stops Just, them. This is getting. And then a cockroach. The juke. Do you understand? Pretty bizarre. Yeah, pretty bizarre. Let me. There, we got everything right this time. We get a different cutscene when we get it right, of course. Oops. Did you break another cup? Oh, wait really? Go, Mom. No refill for you. Shh. Well, now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You He's in him. hell. He's off to go bust some skaters. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Trevor and Justin must be in love. There's a cockroach. You predicted a cockroach on the jukebox? I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. Thank you. This Thank isn't you. a toy, Chloe. I do have to be careful how I use it. Screw that. Of course it's a toy. The best toy ever? You can bang anyone with no strings attached, rewind time, and boom! It's like it never happened. Grow up. Hmm. Maybe you made a move on me and I would never know. You yes, want me to? that's what I did. You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. I don't have time. You did not just say that. Uh, oh, your God. Nose. Too much blow? Hey, are you okay? Too much excitement. 
see what happens when we hook up again. Oh, here we go, Let's bro. Go Starting to take apart your life force. You test your power. You need a sidekick to guide you. Okay, girl wonder. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. Mm-hmm. We even eat like that. I'm telling you, you have infinite food forever. It's incredible. That would be my power. Okay, I eat a Belgian girl. waffle like three or four times in a row. Don't even answer. We have places to go and people to do. Come on, before mom starts some more shit, let's bail. It's Kate Marsh from Blackwell. Big yeah, we need to answer you this. You don't call me once in five years and now you're all over some biatch you see every day at school? I see how you roll. So go ahead, chat up Kate Marsh from Blackwell. I've got other people to hang out with too. Yeah, we have to answer this. I'm sorry, but we have to answer this. Hey, Kate. What's up? Please, don't let your best friend get in the Shut way. up, okay? Chloe! Damn it! I promise, Kate. I won't forget. I swear. Just do your homework and don't stress. I really don't think we should go into this right now. I'll call you later, okay? I can't let. Thanks, Max. If you'd rather chill with Kate, please, go ahead. You are ridiculous. I'm chilling with you, okay? For now, let's rock. We had to answer that. We had to. I'm sorry, that's just how this works. Chloe and Joyce got into an argument. That's just how this works. Oh, it's Frank from the RV. What's up, dude? Yeah, you're starting to get weird. <laughs> 